Hello guys, this is Jay from Jay Weaveworks. Uh, today I have decided to do a tutorial on uh, how to make a washer and uh, we'll be doing this, this uh, specific one. It, it's a spring washer. Uh, I have found on Google and uh, I won't be uh, paying much attention uh, to the dimensions. I will only show you uh, how to do it. So we'll start on the front plane and create a circle. It can be a 16 in diameter. I'm going to accept it and go to the curves panel and pick helix and spiral and you will get a dialog like this. Uh, you will have to pick you don't must but you can you can uh, pick a variable pitch and say uh, it can be uh, 10 here and here 10 and uh, we'll end up with something like this okay accept that and uh, go to the front plane again uh, set yourself uh, normal to the front plane and uh, draw another circle this time we can pick 30 half the size <clears throat> and again go to the helix and spiral and uh, we can say uh, Okay, uh, then again, and uh, this should be fine now. And the whole trick uh, when you create a washer like this is uh, in the in this uh, action. So we'll pick these two surfaces, and this is what you get. <clears throat> it's it's a, a a surface, a very thin surface. Uh, drawn, drawn uh, inside uh, the two helixes we drew uh, <coughs> and so the problem is uh, that this is very very thin uh, we don't have much use of this uh, so we'll go uh, to the insert tab again to boss paste and say thicken okay this option allows you to, to give some uh, depth to this washer we can say two millimeters here and accept this and that's it i hope you have enjoyed uh, in this tutorial that you have found it useful if you did uh, please uh, subscribe and uh, see you next time